It's the most wonderful time. <laughs> la, 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 la. And the one thing we all want to gift our friends with is a great wine to top off our holiday cocktail parties and Woo! dinners. That is the truth. Now, here to help us pick the best wine uh -huh. for our holiday guest is the author of the complete wine course and, and actually Michael Gelman's guru, Kevin yes. Israeli. <laughs> That's right. Kevin, I have said this before. I do believe, in fact, that Kevin is the most important guest we've ever had on our show <laughs> in the history of live. Thank you. But you know, we all, we all throw these cocktail parties. We all okay. have people come over. We go to people's house. Okay. Um, when it comes to top, the top wines and type um, thing to pick, what are we looking for? Well, first Help of all, us. you don't have to spend a lot of money. Uh, I, in, I like that. In the back of my book, I got 500 wines that are under $30. Okay. Two of the major grapes in the world, Sauvignon Blanc and Chardonnay. I love a Sauvignon Blanc. From the, <laughs> the, <laughs> uh, do I have to I, swirl it? Yes. Yeah. Okay, you I'll tell you what. Because you can only taste four things, sweet, sour, bitter, salt, but you can smell over 2,000. Oh, I smell like apricot. <laughs> <laughs> Here. <laughs> Do yourself a favor. After this, we'll put your hand over the top. Just I want to. I want you to get full impact here right now. Okay. Oh, so I thought that's you like that one. Spill it. You like yeah. That? No. Okay. Well, I want to see. I want to see you get it on your hand. But spell it. This is New Zealand. Very mm -hmm. tropical, tropical. Grapefruit, yep. citrus, lemon, lime. All those good things all that make for things. great wine with food. <laughs> when can we drink it, Kevin? Shelf. We've been swirling. Oh, oh, when can we drink? Oh, you got to toast. I'm so yeah. sorry. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. Mmm. Mm. Get it? All that acidity over here? Mm -hmm. Think about shellfish. Think about the... Shellfish, uh, yes. The crab. The, the crab. crab. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, Did you yeah. like it? Yeah, I loved right, it. Now I'm moving to California. Yes, Start California. California, here we go. <laughs> Some of the best wines in the world are coming out of California. Yep, I wouldn't yep. have said that 25 years ago, but I'll say it now. Chardonnay is the number one grape, and it's going to have more body, more flavor, and less acidity. Ready? Do we You're doing a, really well do with we this, but I'm buttery, glad I got the big glasses. Buttery and Chardonnay, a butter bomb. This, butter means a lot of oak. This is a little oak. But we call it the kiss of I oak. I can taste that little kiss oak. Of oak. Yeah. Give it a smell. Don't forget the smell now. Oh, I already smelled it. Oh, I'm, okay. I'm past that. <laughs> I don't see you using your hand anymore, but that's okay. I did my hand oh, a bit. I, you I, are I, so I, behind I, me. Pick I, it up, I, I, Kevin. Yeah, Pick I, it up. <laughs> now, what food goes best with these wines here? Again, that's a shellfish because of the highest city. Okay. This is a Chardonnay. Again, uh, look for an unoaked Chardonnay. This is a winter white. Wouldn't uh, you say? Yes, it's nice? more of a winter white, but you're still going to have like uh, you know shrimp and clams and oysters during the season, so that goes well. This is sort of a versatile one. Overly oaked, it's going to destroy some of the food. So right. try to ask your uh, retailer for an unoaked or. A little oak so how much can we expect to spend though? You said you had a bunch of wines under thirty bucks. That's fifteen. The first one is fifteen dollars. Okay. This this is like uh, twenty twenty five dollars okay. for the Chardonnay. Okay. Now rosé. Everybody like rosé? Yes. It's the Not hottest. Rose. It is without question the hottest wine going right now. You are my best friend. <laughs> And my opinion, again, I, I love the New Zealand Sauvignon Blanc, I like the California Chardonnay. This is from Provence in France, which I think that makes the best stuff. And it's got Provence. the color, the color, the color. The color's beautiful. You know, Christmassy. You're, you're my favorite holiday. guest. Oh, thank you. <laughs> this is a nice, light and easy. Very light. Do people only drink this in the summer, though? Can we drink it whenever we want? Absolutely. And what goes best with this? Everything. This is actually a great aperitif really wine. Light, yeah, like yeah. when people are, it is light. And it's got just the right amount of balance of fruit and acidity. So if somebody's coming into your home, first thing you give them is a little rosé. They'll be very happy campers. Mm, this is a cloudy red wine. Well, it's unfiltered. It's organic. Yeah. It's, uh, and, and again, uh, it's from Oregon. Hey! Oregon. Yes, I've been hearing That's about Oregon wines. Pinot Noir. Some of the best Pinot Noirs mm -hmm. in the world are coming out of Oregon. It's light. It can go with fish. It can go with meat. Mm. Refrigerated. This wine has got high acidity. Pinot Noir. As if you just saw the movie Sideways, uh -huh. you remember I love Pinot? the movie. <laughs> what grape did you like? Pinot Noir? Yeah. Yeah. And why? Because this one, you smell it. You what? know what it's saying? Drink me. Now we're going to find I'm out. I'm cleaning my palate. Please. Yes. Now we're going to find out what's the best bubbly out okay. there. And, and what are your recommendations? I just want to say one thing. Yes, did Kelly. you read that article in the newspaper yes. about the health benefits of champagne? It's lowering calories. It's good for your skin. It's good for your thought process. Whatever <laughs> makes you feel good about there drinking it. Whatever it takes. And, and I will say this. I do have champagne or sparkling wine because champagne is only made in France. So sparkling wine around the world. So okay. if, for example, okay. what we have here today is a test. This is the Super Bowl. Of wine from oh, the guys. I'm ready. Uh, and, and Prosecco. Prosecco, Prosecco is from Italy. Right. Uh, from the Veneto region. You're mm -hmm. gonna have one of the Italian. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I could I could use you in my classes. 
Uh, the, the, the I'm not going to tell you which or is which right now because it's a blind tasting. But one is, one of them one is, is from France, California. It's a sparkling wine from California, and with different price ranges okay. here. Okay. And also one is a French champagne. I'm okay. just I'm eyeballing. Oh, it. I'm oh no, 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 no 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 no! I'm looking at the bubbles. Oh okay. I'm not looking at the wine. Yeah, the wine. bubbles are talking <laughs> to her. Here we go, guys. Here okay. we go. All right, That's here we okay. go. And start with the left. Okay. Start with the left. Yeah, and actually, what you're looking for but here I is can't. bubbles. There's billions, believe it or not, billions of bubbles in a bottle of champagne. Oh wait, so there's one of each on each thing. Right. Let me oh, let okay. me hand. Uh, wait, oh, wait, let me hand it to you. I'll be honest with you. It tastes better blindfolded. The real blind tasting, Michael. You got it going here. So, looking for bubbles, you're looking for fruit, you're looking for acidity, and this is the perfect way to start. Do off. you do this to champagne? No, no. That's that that that. You just took, out, you just took out all the bubbles, Michael. But it's okay. Don't worry about it. Number one. Okay. That was number one. You're right, you're on number three. I'm on number three. Yeah. <laughs> number three. She's a Kelly's already this on number is, three. Yeah. I'm, I'm Michael's behind saying, schedule. This right is. Now. I'm going to say. Okay. Taste them all. Yeah. Yeah. Because I, you know. We don't want to put you on the spot here right now. Blind tasting, and also champagne and sparkling wine is the hardest thing to taste. <laughs> okay, I think I know. All right. I'm yeah. going to say, ready? Go, go ahead. Prosecco. Right. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. They're doing a good job. You Champ know what? I'm going to say this. California. I could care less. <laughs> Your favorite. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Prosecco, sparkling wine, champagne. Champagne? Okay. Ooh. Wait, which number was that? I don't know. That was. <laughs> <laughs> Prosecco. Okay. Okay. And the last one, whatever it was. I said this <laughs> was sparkling wine, I believe. All right, it's out of California, and it is a sparkling wine. Two out of three. Three out of three. You know what? I've always wanted to be good at something, and I finally found my talent. You, you did. It's, it's, it's working. And this here is, um, let me do the unveiling yes, right now. Ready? Yes. Michael? Prosecco, which is the great thing about Prosecco, like $15 a bottle. Fantastic. Right. Sparkling wine at $15. The only difference is they, 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 they do this in a big tank. All of the next two, they're fermented in the bottle themselves. Ah. That's called the method uh, tra traditionnel, et cetera. Rotorer. It's a French champagne house, but it's in California in the Anderson Valley. Hmm. One of my favorites there. And Veuve Clicquot. Veuve Clicquot champagne. Clicquot. So this is $15. 15 to $30. $15 to $30 to $50 okay. plus dollars. Okay, so that's the difference. That's the only difference. If you can't taste the difference, why pay the difference? I that's all say, I say. I will say one thing about um, Veuve Clicquot. It doesn't <laughs> leave you with a hangover. You're, you're right. One thing. Uh, champagne and sparkling wine has low alcohol. Mm -hmm. Very low alcohol, so you guys did a great job. Congratulations! Well, I get a hug. Right now. Kevin is really thank <laughs> you. you. The Green <laughs> Wine Course. Make sure you check that out. All the information is on our website. There, everybody, we're gonna party at the break. But when we come back, it's Disney on Ice. We're gonna put this on ice. Thank you, Michael. Kevin, thank you, man. That was awesome. That was awesome, brother.